it's Nicole. Today's video is going to be my Ipsy unbagging. I just finished filming like the worst video I've ever filmed in my life um, and it's going up tomorrow. I fixed my makeup from it and I still feel a little nauseous so if you're curious now just tune into my channel tomorrow and you'll see what I'm talking about. I'm super excited for my Ipsy bag this month because I saw some spoilers on what the bag looked like and it looks super Halloween-y and fun and October-y and my my birch box and glossy box were not Halloween themed. I was very disappointed. This is the bag. Ooh. I love this bag. Like, look, there's little ghosties and witches and magic potions. And the little zipper guy is a ghost. So this is really cute. I really like Halloween themed things. I wanna order some Halloween themed stuff to like unbox on my channel, but I don't know what to do yet. So hey, hit me up with some suggestions and I'll, I'll get on that. So the first product in my Ipsy bag is a brush. This brush is from Lottie London and it is, I'm assuming a little eyeshadow brush. Uh, I would probably use this to pack on product, I guess. Uh, I have a decent amount of brushes like this, but I love getting tools in my subscription boxes because eventually with samples and stuff, you're gonna run because eventually with samples and stuff, you're gonna run out, uh, but tools never go bad, unless it's like a sponge. Would you please stay? I don't have time for your problems right now. The next product in here is a liquid liner by Essence, and this is a super fine liner, so let's just see how super fine that is. That tip looks so precise. I am very excited for this. I love Essence as a brand. It's really cheap and I need a super fine liner because my liner is not on point right now. The next product in here is Indie Beauty Buttercream Antioxidant Lip Scrub. That smells really nice. I like the texture of that. I can't exactly pinpoint what it smells like, but I guess buttercream, I don't know. The next product in here is Hot Mama by The Bomb Cosmetics. And this is a shadow and a blush. I love all the products that I get from The Bomb, but this pan is way too small to be a blush. This is a really nice color. Um, I will definitely use it as an eyeshadow. I might try and make it work as blush anyway, because it's a really pretty color with kind of like a golden sheen to it. The last product in here is by Beauty Basics, and it is an eyeshadow in the shade Satin Taupe. So this pan size is a lot more generous. Uh, that is definitely a full size shadow, I'd say. I don't know if this comes in a palette or anything. I'm not familiar with this brand, but whoa, that is very pigmented. Wow, I swatch in like the worst places here. That is a pigmented taupe shade with uh, kind of like a metallic sheen, I'd say. Yeah, definitely metallic sheen. So overall, this bag was super awesome. I got a tool, which is full size. I got a full size liner, a full size shadow. I mean, it Jeez. It is really cool getting three full-size things in here. I'm so excited about the lip scrub. Your lips get super dry in the winter, at least mine do. So lip scrubs are always really good to use before your lipsticks. And this little bomb shade is also really cute. And I feel like a pink look would kind of bring back the uh, blossoms of spring. I don't know what I'm saying right now. So I'm just gonna sign off. If you wanna subscribe to Ipsy or any of the other subscription boxes I am subscribed to, I have all the links down below. If you wanna see more content, even better than unboxings, cause I have a great video for tomorrow, uh, click the subscribe button down below and also give this video a thumbs up. As always, thank you guys so much for being here and look forward to tomorrow because tomorrow is cray.